G'day everyone, out of Triple Five here. In today's video, I've got a little bit of a different uh, helmet to try out. This is just uh, me breathing. <laughs> In today's video, we've got 20 minutes of me breathing into the microphone. <sighs> So in today's video, I'm just going to be testing out my new helmet. This is an adventure helmet. It is a MX-9 adventure helmet, to be precise, by Bell. And it is a helmet that I have got in preparation for my new motorcycle, which is an adventure motorbike. So I've gone on ahead and 3D printed a chin mount for it. And I've got my Sony camera mounted to it. And this is just a test run with a microphone installed. I got the um, E... ECM-LV1 microphone that I highly recommend for the Sony camera setup. So, you know, I'm just doing a test run now of the microphone set up inside the chin mount. So this microphone is a pretty awesome microphone. It's a stereo microphone and it should be picking up a lot of my voice nice and clearly with my setup. I have got the same microphone in my other helmet and it seems to be doing a good job so I figured I'd buy another one and pop it in this helmet to see how that goes. I am keeping my Honda CTX 700 in case you're you're wondering and you're a little bit unsure um, so don't unsubscribe if that's why you're on my channel. I'm certainly keen to still ride my motorcycle. I, I love this bike and it's great for commuting so there'll still be content on the channel w w for this bike. But you know like any grown man that loves to buy toys a second motorcycle is just around the corner for me to purchase so I'm, I'm literally as of this video I'm waiting for it to come in, in um, into the shop for me to buy. So this helmet is Excellent! I think this is a really good helmet for an adventure style of riding. The visibility is great. It's got this huge uh, visor on it. It doesn't have built-in sunglasses, but it is compatible with goggles, so I've got them on the inside. And they're tinted, so win-win. And it's got the ear cutouts inside it for a Cardo headset or or sent or a scener if I wanted to but uh, I'd definitely go Cardo again because of their superiority and weather protection and I'm an all-round rider who rides in the rain and I don't want things to short out because of a little bit of inclement weather anyway this is purely just a quick test video and you know why not I've taken the baffle out of the fake exhaust so um, I can uh, do some rev bombs although this security system set up here is a bit uh, concerning Anyway, they must be um, stopping me from doing burnouts here all the time. So, anyway, this helmet is, um, yeah, seems to be the bomb. I, I really like it. It's comfortable. It's, you know, it's modern. It's bright. It matches my high-vis vest, so I can't really complain. And anyway, um, I think a lot of these people are out here dogging, so let's uh, continue on. So I'm really hoping that I've hit the nail on the head with this microphone placement in the camera. And I've literally just put it inside on the other side of this chin grill, on the other side of the foam, on the other side of it. Um, and then if I can just say on the other side of it again, it just seems to be the word I'm saying. I really hope I've hit the nail on the head with its placement and it sounds nice and clear. I do have a 3D printer and I've 3D printed this chin mount and I downloaded the, des the design and had to edit it to make it even longer. So that's why it is such a long mount. It's specifically for this Sony camera. Maybe I'll have to uh, get a different camera in the future if I don't want the mount to be so long. Well, that's it for today's video. Let me know what you think of my new helmet setup and uh, wish me all the best for my adventure riding. If you've got any tips and tricks for this sort of helmet setup for motor vlogging, I I'm keen to hear it. Or if you've got an adventure style helmet and you've got some tips, let me know. I was thinking about maybe putting a battery pack on the back of it to balance off the, the massive uh, chin mount, but I don't know. What, what do you think of that? As usual, keep safe out there on the road. Stay on two wheels and not on your head. And I'll see you all next Tuesday. Laters!